Yes guys, how to find low competition keywords for YouTube. Let's go. Guys, hope you guys are well. Guys, I won't be long. But look, I'm gonna show you something very quickly. This is how I do it, right? So, um, like I said, um, I think I've said it in, my, in, in another video. Um, one of my channels, because I've got a few channels, I did an experiment where how to rank very quickly on a first page. So you can see like, this is the top of the page. This is one of my gigs um, I showed you. I'll, I'll go through it in another video and you can see, look, here I am here probably like in within a month I'm ranked on the first page on the fourth fifth spot wherever it is now this is how to do it guys this is how to do it how to find low competition you gotta find low competition keywords now I use something called vidIQ you can use vidIQ you can use TubeBuddy they're really both excellent uh, probably one of the better um, softwares for SEO YouTube SEO um, like I said, I use vidIQ and TubeBuddy, both of them, because they're both excellent. If you want to try it out for free, check out my the link in my description, and you can just play around with it and see how it works for you. But guys, check this out. So basically, what I do is, if you put a keyword in, right? So let's say how to rank five a gig on first page. That's the video that I did where I ranked on the first page, basically. And you can see on the thumbnails, it's called exactly the same thing. I think I've showed people before on this, how to rank it or how to rank it on the thumbnail. Um, but anyway, so it could be anything though, guys. It doesn't even have to be this, but you can see here, it's all green because it's their low competition. It's a low competition keyword. Look, when I go to overview on here, you can see that it scores really highly, 64, which is amazing, low competition. But what you want to do is, you want to find low competition keywords. Now, I don't know what it is that you want to do a video on, but before you do the video, you need to think about what it is that you um, you need to think about the keywords, whether they rank or not. So what I would do is you type in anything. I don't know. It could be like you want to talk about how to how to um, um, do a barbecue set or how to put a barbecue or what's the best barbecue set. Let's say let's say you want to type in what is the best barbecue barbecue set right this is a random one but let's see but i just want to show you how it works so what's the best barbecue set okay then just let me just try that out okay now look just as an experiment it shows you that the competition is too high and uh, for that set of keywords and the search volume is okay it's not bad it's medium but now, if I go to view all 14 keywords, it might give me an option of uh, something that is a little bit less competition. So you can see all of these keywords to do with barbecuing or grilling or whatever it is, is like really high. But let me click on overall at the top. Now, probably the, the, the less, the least amount of competition is here on the amber section at the top. And then it says it gives you how to barbecue right. So how, how to barbecue right has got a good volume, but the competition is pretty high too. So if I click on that, you can see that the competition is, is medium, not as bad as before. Now let me click on view all 447 keywords, because from there it seems like there's quite a lot of keywords. And then I click overall. And actually what you start finding is from that initial keyword you can actually get other words that you might be able to rank for um less competition so here are the green ones so let's have a look um stuffed boneless chicken thighs so if you did a video which is related to barbecuing about stuffed boneless chicken thighs you get a search volume of about 2672 and it's low competition because you're in the green so this is how you start finding out what works because if you just done a video solely on maybe how to barbecue right which is this top one here which has a high competition you probably wouldn't rank and you won't be seen on youtube so it's very important to start searching through an software seo things that might actually work let me go to matching terms this is there anything that's matching and then let me see if i can find anything through this way so the best one here says blazing bull how to barbecue right that sounds like a, a an okay one uh, let's look at questions about barbecuing yep there are questions on barbecuing again it's it's kind of there are some lowish lowish ones but you have to get the right thing right so you know the right um the correct term so how to barbecue right potato salad 2000 with some lowish competition yeah so 
that's how you find out guys that's how you do your research first of all think about what kind of video you want to do go to a software like vidIQ or TubeBuddy and then type in the keywords that you think you want to talk about so I don't know like I said it could be barbecue and it could be gaming it could be uh, explaining certain things that you want to talk about it could be about cars whatever it is um, you know uh, type it in and then see if it works so I don't know it might be a car review uh, let's talk about I don't know Porsche car review you know you might like cars and you want to talk about cars I don't know it's up to you and then what you see is the overview here the, the score is pretty low again that's that's a high competition one I could imagine that would be high competition and then what you do is you go to the keywords and you click overall and see what you could maybe rank for so actually on the top one is 911 car review search volume 2400 and it's a bit low it's not quite in the green but it's low so if I click that keyword actually which is interesting 911 keyword and I go to view all 39 keywords because obviously you're going to see if there's anything that you can rank for. Again, you know, um, it's it's quite a high competition one, that one. You know, you can get some low. There is some low, but you have to be real specific. And the key thing is the more words there are, the more specific you get in the niche, the better. So, for example, if you want to talk about fast cars, that's not going to work. If you say Porsche, that might not work but if you say 911 Porsche a review on a 911 Porsche you're getting more specific more into the niche then you're more likely to rank in that respect but guys that's how you find uh, keywords that's how you get low competition keywords by really drilling down and finding something using something like vidIQ or TubeBuddy where you can uh, start finding keywords that you can work around guys and then that you can rank for because like i said there's no point in you trying to rank for something when there's a lot of competition so like i said if i go back to my original um, keywords that i've used for for example the video that i showed you actually funny enough there are so many uh keywords um low competition keywords that i can actually do videos on and because this is the niche so, for example, my niche was talking about Fiverr, which is a, a sort of a platform where you can sell services of designing, whatever it is. So if I go to all 55 keywords around this, you can see there are a lot of green here. Look, it's amazing. So if you're talking about a certain software, if you're talking about something specific, a certain niche, then you probably will find lots of lots of opportunities of doing keywords. Look at this. This is all green pretty much. Amazing. Like there's so many like so many low competition keywords that I could rank for right now um, and hence why I got onto the first page guys you can see look first page wasn't too hard and wasn't too difficult and it's much harder when you do other ones so guys check out vidIQ in, in the description and play around with it and see if it works for you guys you can just try it out for free but guys that's exactly how you do it if you want to check it out um, check out my other videos on the playlist where I kind of go into a little bit more detail on how to rank better and so on Guys, if you like the video, hit the like, subscribe, smash the notification bell, guys, and I'll see you on the next video. Take care.